Sure, yeah. Um, well, after Montana, I just felt like I wanted to keep traveling. Like, I felt like I was going to come back to Montana and live there permanently, but here I am, which I'm happy I'm here. Um, and anyway, I was working for a friend, and we I lived like I was out of the 1800s. No running water, no bathrooms. Um, it was just amazing, and he had told me that wild horses would come up um, cause he kind of tended to them and they started to get comfortable there. And one day I was laying rock down, trying to make a rock path and the mom, dad, and the baby horse all came together down this beautiful mountainside. Oh my God. <sighs> and I was like, holy crap. I think those are the horses. And I was just so like nervous excited and happy I, you know i'm a little nervous because i don't know how they're going to be with me and they finally made their way to me and they just hung out with me and so as time went by they started to get to know me and i would go outside with my guitar and just i was trying to create this song of how i was feeling and what i was kind of going through and it was so cute because I wish I had a video, but they just like stood around me listening to the <laughs> song that I made. <laughs> so yeah, I felt kind of like a wild horse at the time, I guess. And out came this song too. So this is called Wild Horse. <laughs> 